finding It's been the best role I've ever played. Playing um, a sweet transvestite from transsexual Transylvania. It's just the, one of the best parts ever. I've been doing it since uh, April. Such a great show. It's just amazing, and I've been loving every single minute of it. How does it compare to being in blue, performing with with your bandmates? I will always love being in blue, you know, that's my bread and butter, that's what I've always done. But you know, being in a show like Rocky Horror has just been it's just been so much fun and it's such an iconic role, you know. And Rodrigo seen it, how many times have you seen it now? Eleven. Eleven times. Eleven times, yeah. So he's like you know. Which, your, which one was your favourite time? Which uh, one or eleven? One one, two, three, four, five? <laughs> every single time. <laughs> really, every single time. It's really awesome, incredible sport. Where did you two meet? Brussels, where he lives. Right. Do you speak French? Yes. Ah, je parle français. <laughs> oui. Mais, enchanté. Ouais, enchanté. Um, <laughs> so I, I should ask a serious question. Um, so in uh, as the you know a part of the LGBT community, how important is it for you to be sort of outspoken within the community? Well, do you know what? For a long time, I was really frightened to come out. I was in the public eye in a boy band, and I was really scared to kind of come out and identify as, as gay. Um, we had a lot of female fans, and 10 years ago when I did come out, you know, it was, it was still harder then. I mean, it's still never easy for people to come out, but I think it's becoming a lot more acceptable now, and it's becoming a lot more easy now, but there's still, you know, a, a long way to go. But, um, you know, back then I was I was just frightened, really, and had a lot of fears and insecurities about it. But it's the best thing I've ever done. And, and now with my story, I've, I've helped so many people, and I hope that people can reach out and talk to me if they're frightened or scared. And I'm always on my social media speaking to people about it. And it's, it's been wonderful hearing people's stories and, and just knowing that I've helped certain people with their stories and coming out has been great. I did a big campaign for um, P&G, for the Ferry campaign. Um, for the Albert Kennedy Trust. And it was just a really important campaign for me to do. See, and um, to be a part of that was just amazing and to help fly the flag and, and bring awareness. And in terms of, so you've done you've done the, the music, you've done theatre, yeah. would you transition, would you ever think of transitioning into film or big franchises like the, Mar like the Marvel franchise? I mean, amazing. I would love to, you know, never never say never. I, I'm always open to new opportunities that come my way. And I've just enjoyed singing and acting and, and doing doing everything over the last 20 years that I've had the opportunity to do. I've been very blessed. So, you know, whatever comes my way is is, is a bonus. Perfect. Well, it was great speaking to you. Obviously, I said I was starstruck. Um, yeah. <laughs>